That's right, everyone. We are back at Legoland Florida. We are here because this is the opening weekend of their Pirate Fest event, which will be happening on weekends during the month of February. Featuring some specialty foods, some games, character photo ops, and some new shows. And one of the new shows they're featuring is called Captain Brickbeard's Water Sports Stunt Show, which is a water ski show. So we're going to be checking that out. All right. It's a little busy today, but that's okay. We're here on a Saturday, so that's probably why. And at the start of this event, too. So here we go. I do love how they have stickers. Alright, so here we are near the historic Cypress Garden section. And along the shores of Lake Eloise. Where the new... Where the new shows look at. Yeah. 
yell this pirate insult. Right. Every time this flag goes up or someone says no, port or give it, you are all the wrong. So make sure you're paying attention. Uh, now today's what? It's bloated barnacles. <laughs> bloated barnacles, got it? Bloated barnacles. Perfect. The best fire insults are said with courage and conviction. So let's
Savvy. <laughs> no, this is how it works. You will sing Yo-Ho after every line in each song. So every time I point to you, sing Yo-Ho. Got it? Yeah. Wonderful. Let's give it the old pirate school try. Give up pirate school yell. Yeah.
will sweep you off your foot. I should hope so. You can bet your booty on it. Ah, I do have fantastic booty. It's rather ample, Captain. Very large booty indeed. Right. So, these students, all as I can say is that they better be better than those bootless chum-eating sea snakes that we had in the last class. And you know I know what you know what I know. You know? Right. What happens in Davy Jones' locker stays in Davy Jones' locker. So, the order of business. A three-part final test. <laughs> the first test. Let's see how they hit a broadside. You see, the first rule of pirates, you bilge rats. No prey, no pay. And here on this lake, if there's no spray, no way do they make me cruel. No quarter given. No, not again. Through all the boats, the boats did not go. Did I just hear you insult me?
section is a doozy. It needs to be fantastic. Oh, you mean something like this?
if you'd like to meet me crew and some of our graduating students, head outside of the stadium to the port side. That's left for all you land lovers out there. And to celebrate this graduation, a pyro cannon salute. I've really very much enjoyed that. It's great to see the ski show again, but uh, it was awesome. I enjoyed that. It was a lot of fun, a lot of uh, interesting jokes. <laughs> it's a fun show, so I would recommend it. Not only for people that uh, love water skiing, but uh, pirates as well. It was fun. I enjoyed that. In the previous video, the first time I was here, I spoke about the rich hi history of uh, where Legoland is located. One was known, at, or was formerly known as Cypress Gardens, and the section of the park is actually right there. These water ski stadiums right here are actually a part of the original Cypress Gardens. Right here on historic and world famous Lake Eloise. So seeing the water ski show performed here again was pretty awesome. A lot of rich history here. Before uh, Legoland came along, so we're really excited that Legoland kept the historic botanical garden section. And again, I talked about all this in a previous video. And I'll link that up in the corner. All right. I might uh, return and watch the show again later. The shows are at 12, 2, and 4. So, and uh, this show is going to be presented week, is uh, presented daily. It's not a part, it's not weekends only, it is a daily show. At least whenever Legoland is open. Alright. This crowd's thin out a little bit. I'm going to go down and check out this. All right, so as you can see, RFS is every weekend through the month of February. Featuring some pirate shows going on. And of course, pirate characters that you can check out. Head towards Lego City so you can catch these shows over here, part of the past weekends. Then we'll be back to see Captain Rick Beard again. I probably won't record it. <laughs> okay, well, for the first though, we're gonna find some lunch. A little hungry. Where are you going? Okay, in this area there are three shows that take place for Pirate Fest. There's one there, and then there's two that takes place right there. Fortunately, it just rained, so the show that was scheduled for 1.30 has uh, been canceled, so... I'm gonna see that one. I might have it coming another weekend. Uh, for a full listing of what's going on during the event, you may want to visit the uh, Legoland Florida website. All the information is listed right there. So that'll help you out with uh, learning all you want to know about the Pyro Fest weekends here at Legoland, Florida. All right. So, part of uh, Pyro Fest, you got food, there's games, photo ops, and of course shows. Weather permitting, of course. Okay, next show up there is at 2.30, next show over there, which is Treasure Bound, or Treasures Abound, is at 3. 
So hopefully we can get back over here to see those two shows a bit later on. It's currently almost 1.30. So what I'm thinking is I'm going to go back and see Captain Rickbeard the Water Sports stunt show again. Yeah, it really just did rain, so a lot of these rides are uh, shut down, getting ready for restart. So, all right, let's it on. There's also a little show that happens right here. But unfortunately, due to the weather, this performance has been canceled. So, we'll try to catch it again later. I love how they got stickers down on the, on the walkway. Directing you to the show. I love it. <laughs> so, yep, we're back over here. Fire's gold. Now, when Legoland opened, they did have a pirate have a pirate ski show. This is a new version, so a completely different new version of the show. And Legoland is celebrating their 10th birthday this year. Yep, Legoland Florida is now 10 years old. How about that? Yep, photo op opportunity. In the Cypress Gardens day era, this used to be a boat dock. In the Cypress Gardens era. Not anymore, obviously. In fact, what's left of that boat dock is right there. And again, on a previous video, I uh, documented all this, including the, uh, the gardens in detail. Hmm. Looks like this pathway is currently closed due to high water levels. Yeah, it is looking a little high. <laughs> All right, we're not going to venture too far into the gardens because, uh, well. But uh, we will take a little look around. Looks like they've been doing some repair work over here. And looks like they're trying to shore it up. I talked about this in a previous video, but uh, you used to you can take boat a boat tour through these canals. We did Cypress Gardens the era. And there used to be Southern Bell, it's like up there where that Legoland, where that one made out of Legos, we used to sit out here on the lawn and wave at the people and the boats. So it looks like they're putting in some new barriers by the looks of it, probably to help keep the uh, shore from eroding. So I love that Legoland is, uh, preserving these beautiful botanical gardens. Something that made Cypress Gardens 
who, you know, that really was Cypress Gardens back in the era, back in the day. Yeah, the water level is definitely high, as evidenced by that right there. So because of that, many of these pathways are closed. Oh well. I think it's time to head over and uh, go see for the show. Again. Yeah, here's the same for what this show is all about. If you want to be a pilot, you're going to have to keep that burden down. Uh, it is right, you can hear us, pirates coming from a mile away. So, let's try that again with everyone, but louder this time. Here we go. One, two, three. That's more on. Wonderful. Now, let's talk some pirates and we go. Ooh, treasure is called booty. Your family is now... Sabatina, ahoy there! Believe it or not, Sabatina be our mystical mind reader. 
to say I've had quite the adventure. Oh yeah, I met those two along the way. Pickpocket Jack and One-Eyed Jackie. The most wanted bandits in all the seven brick seas. Why, yes, we are. Bandits or not, we be good pals now. I never would have found this island alone. to see you too, Sabatina. What's with all the attitude around oh, here? Look, oh, 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 over here. Ah, looks like you all need to escape and stretch your wings. I know just what will do the trick. The parrot dance. The parrot dance. That's what I said. Now listen up. A parrot's mind is always clever. He speaks his mind and says whatever. However, he'll ruffle some feathers along the way. Start a flying, boy, you think that I'd be lying. Easy, move your body and start to sway. <laughs> well, that's enough for me. Now get on your feet and let me teach you how it goes. You heard the parents, everybody, stand up. That's it, everyone. Oh, I see you back there. Stand up. Okay, stand up. first, flap your wings. Oh, yes. Yeah.
pirate crews dare bother us now. Great job, crew. Now let's tie up that rope and continue on with our adventure. What do you say, Popsy? Mark, let's find this treasure. Ooh, and I have just the item to do the trick. My handy, dandy metal detector. Yes. You've had that here the entire time? Oh, yes, I'm a thief. I don't go anywhere without it. Well, then, what are we waiting for? Turn it on. Now, just follow the beeping sound. <laughs> Jack, the beeping stop. This is never going to work. Oh, here it goes again. Wait a minute. Listen. It's getting faster. Maybe it's inside. Eureka! What did we found it? Wait, grab it all. There's plenty to go around. Well, open it up. Guys, did you look in your bags yet? Hang on. This looks like a bird seed. It's beautiful. Oh, my, 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 my. Beautiful? Why do you think I gave you pirates the map? You found me parent family's precious hidden treasure. So you're telling me we sailed the seven brick seas, claimed a new island, hoisted, fought, sung, all for bird seed? That's not treasure. Sure it is. That's treasure to me. is really quite the thing. Sharing jokes and funny stories upon the open seas, that is all this pirate needs. Yo ho, yo ho, that's treasure to me. See, it's not really about riches. Come on, crew, what does treasure mean to you? Just give me the ocean, a crew to hoist the sail, a promise of adventure, and some money to make bail. <laughs>
show. All right, moving on. It's a cute show, kind of like it. says goes. Wait, 
speed it up again. That was not on the to-do list. Good luck. to always work, never take breaks, and never be lazy. Hm. I think our pirates have another tune in mind. If you would like to learn the real pirate anthem, then stand up, put one hand over your eye, and repeat after us. No work tomorrow. No work tomorrow. No work today. No work today. Lay in the sun, have some fun. The lazy pirate way, oh ho! Lay in the sun, have some fun. The lazy pirate way, oh ho! Huh. Wow, you all are well on your way to becoming lazy pirates. Let's put it all together. Here we go! No work tomorrow. No work tomorrow! No work today. No work today! Lay in the sun, have some fun. The lazy pirate way, yo ho! Lay in the sun, have some fun. The lazy pirate way, yo ho! Lazy pirates? Not on my crew! The both of you are one step away from walking the plank! I better see you act like real pirates and quick! Oh no. Walking the plank. Every pirate's nightmare. Our sailors needed to show the captain they had what it takes to be on the crew. They decided to do what every pirate does best. Sword fight! our pirates weren't the best at hand-to-hand -hand combat. They needed to find some way to show that they had what it takes to fly the skull and crossbones. They thought and they searched when suddenly the answer became extremely clear. Pirate trumpet! That's right. Pirate to pirate, stick to stick, hook to hook. One way or another, one will come out a winner. Okay, here we go. 
Okay, now this is Miniland. This is where obviously everything's made out of Legos. And yes, in a previous video I did showcase this. The reason why we're doing it like this and why it's closed off is as you can see, this whole area, there's no shade. You are fully exposed, you are in the sun. So now, what Legoland is doing for their 10th anniversary is they are installing a shade structure. That's right, they're going to be putting in an actual shade structure. So how cool is that? So, eventually all this will be undercover. So you'll be able to really enjoy looking at the... enjoying Mini, mini Land under the cover. So that's going to be a lot of fun. All right, can't wait for that. And of course, we will be back. Of course, in the meantime, they got this little display set up right here. All right. So let's say they're getting ready for another we're already, yep, they're getting ready for another show because skier in position, ready to go. All right. Well, we had a great time here uh, for Legoland Florida's Pirate Fest. Again, this is every weekend during the month of February. And we didn't get to see there's probably a couple of things that we missed. 
And like I said earlier, I do recommend that you, uh, if you're interested in Pirate Weekends, that, that you please uh, visit the Legoland website, and they'll tell you, and they'll tell you a whole lot more about what's going on. Again, these are the weekends. So definitely come and check out Pirate Fest weekends. It's a lot of fun. But do visit the Legoland's uh, website. It'll give you a lot more information. Tell you what, everything what happens. Because there's games. There's even special foods. There's even a lot more shows, so, and of course, Captain Brickbeard's Water Sports Stunt Show. Moving on. Okay, and there you have it. That's going to do it for now. We will be back as this will be a month-long event every weekend, so we will be back for more Pirate Fest sometime before the end of February. All right, guys, that's going to do it. Bye now.